here's the update on my A3 control with the Ladybird Lover. This one is on the chili plant, which has had one of the worst infestations. It's grown a huge amount. The, um, the both the plant and the aphid larva and the um, ladybird larva. And fortunately, it's pretty much cleared up the problem completely. <coughs> I mean, a lot of the um, a lot of the um, larva from the ladybird have actually left now because they've finished, and obviously they can't find any food. That's worked really well. Um, it's a shame that they all seem to have disappeared. I'm guessing they just kind of run around, maybe onto the new plants, maybe disappearing around my house, hopefully not. But I've also got other ones I had on this one, my frangipani plant, but unfortunately I was spraying my frangipani with pesticide about um, two months ago, maybe one, one month ago, and that's obviously killed off all the, um, sorry, the ladybird larva. Um, that black spot is a dead one there. I must have put on about 20 or 30 on the plant, but every single one has just been killed and died. I must have eaten the, the larva, probably a bioaccumulator of the pesticide, and it's killed the, um, eating the aphids has killed the, the um, ladybird larva. So, I've gone out and bought SB and Big Plant Invigorator. It's uh, basically, I think it's a soap, so it basically kills it by contact, by suffocating the, the insects. It's supposed to be, you're, you're supposed to be able to use it and then within a couple of days use beneficial insects, but with, as this has got systemic pesticide already in this plant, I can't use them. But it's, it's, it's working moderately well at the moment. Um, I used it a few days ago. It's what, it also feeds the plant as well. And... Um, you can see those black spots there, there's quite a lot of dead dead aphids, there's still a few living aphids so hasn't completely cleared up the problem but it's not too bad and I'll definitely um, keep at it and see what it does but it also seems to have given the leaves a slightly darker tinge I think that's the iron in it because iron often increases the chlorophyll count so keep on with that <coughs> 